Moving right along here on Recruiting Insider. Nick Faust, the number nine shooting guard in the nation. He's from Baltimore, but looking at programs from coast to coast. One local kid decided to stay home. Will Nick decide to stay in Baltimore, at least close there as well? We're going to find out as Nick Faust is going to join us to make his live commitment coming up on Recruiting Insider. As we look at some of the top shooting guards out there, we could have one of those similar situations with Nick Faust. Faust is the number nine shooting guard in the nation and the top undecided prospect at that position. What do you like about his game? Well, he's an excellent three-point shooter. He can break open a game with consecutive threes. Distance and accuracy are not a problem for this young guy. He has a young-looking face and a thin athletic frame, but don't let that fool you into thinking that this kid can't play. He can drop big numbers on opponent in a heartbeat. His stock has really risen over the past half year. What are the reasons behind that? Well, he had a great spring and summer this year for Baltimore Elite, and he emerged as one of the best shooting guards in the nation. Well, Nick Faust is ready for his moment in the spotlight. He's going to join us just in a bit here from Baltimore, Maryland, and consider making up his mind. In fact, he's going to do that. You see some of the schools right there on the list for the number nine shooting guard in the ESPN U100. Well, let's bring in Nick Faust right now and send it to him. Who are the final five? And at this point, who made it possible to get down to that final list? Well, my final five is Oregon State, Florida State, Marquette, Maryland, and Villanova. Who was influential? And the in, that made this. Yeah, getting down to that final five. Who was influential in making that happen, Nick? Well, the people that contributed and supported me was my parents, um, also my pastor, my AAU coach, and my high school coach. But also, I'd like to thank God because without him, nothing else would be possible. A lot of people waiting for this moment, especially up there in your hometown of Baltimore. So, Nick, where are you going to play your college basketball? Well, me and my family have decided that I'll be taking my services to the University of Maryland. Look at that. The hometown team strikes once again. Nick is going to be staying close to home there from Baltimore and playing for the Maryland Terrapins. Why was it Maryland in the end? Because it felt like a second home to me, and it was ultimately like I had a great relationship with the coaches, and also I felt as though that was the best place for me to mature on and off the court. How do you think you fit in right off the bat for Gary Williams? I think I would come in and be a great contributor to the offense and defensive side. Uh, the flex offense fits my style of play very well. Well, you heard Coach Biancardi saying you got that baby face. Why is that a little deceiving when you look at you and your game? Well, I would say it's deceiving because a lot of players think like, oh, he's a little guy, he can't really score, but ultimately I just destroy him. <laughs> there we go. The little guy will get you. Look out for Nick Faust. Nick, at this point, you were one of the prospects that's really blown up over the past half year or so. How'd you do that? Well, all of this came down to a lot of hard work that paid off. You know, I worked out every day, got my consistency up, and just played hard. Well, you put out the warning shot on why you should fear Nick Faust. How about the warning shot, why should you fear the turtle in the next few years? We're going to be winning the national championship. There we go. You're the man on the spot. You know, Nick, they're going to roll this back in about two or three years. Nick Faust saying we're going to win the national championship. You will hear more from this day. Congratulations, buddy, on that verbal commitment to play for Maryland. Thank you. That is the confidence you want to see. That's the confidence that I'm sure they're loving with Maryland. I told you this guy can put up big numbers on opponents. He's not going to hesitate. He'll put the dagger right in the heart. Well, Nick said it's going to lead to a national championship down the road. That's at least what they are gunning for with the Maryland Terrapins. But big picture, what does this do for Maryland going forward? Well, this is huge for Maryland because it gives them credibility in recruiting on the court and in the recruiting circles. Look, Gary Williams is a tremendous coach. He makes his players better and tougher. But at times they've struggled keeping the local talent home. With Nick Faust, they get an impact player and a local player who could be the face of the program for years to come. I really like his potential. And we've seen that now with two straight verbal commits. Nick Faust deciding to stay close to home at Baltimore. Adonis Thomas doing the same thing with Memphis. When it comes to that statement, what does it do to the other prospects out there in very fertile recruiting grounds when you make that statement, I'm staying home? Well, Baltimore and Memphis, very fertile grounds. 
other players are going to want to stay with them and come and play for them for years to come. It builds your recruiting base. It makes it easier for the head coach to go out and recruit now. Yeah, 